Hey hi, this is Varsha and welcome to the QA Belt in my YouTube channel. So this is the fourth video of my Selenium automation series. And uh, in my previous videos, I had explained like how we can do the basic setup, initial setup for UI automation and uh, how we can write a first script in Selenium basically. How we can launch the browser, how we can close it. So basically we used one predefined method uh, in Selenium like close uh, where we can uh, call this method using an object of web driver interface. And in this in this today's session, I'll explain you like uh, how we can uh, close a complete browser which was operated by or any specific automation script. So let's understand one scenario here. Like in your any specific automation script, if you clicked on any hyperlink, so it will redirect it to any particular uh, tab or particular window, and uh, uh, that's how Selenium will open multiple windows uh, in automation. So after completing your test script execution, uh, you want to close this particular browsers, particular tabs, uh, which was operated by automation. So uh, how we, how you can do that? So in Selenium, we have one predefined method like uh, quit method. Uh, and uh, with the help of web driver interface, we can call this method like uh, driver.quit. So uh, and that way we can close our complete browser or complete tabs which was opened by this automation script. So uh, let me show you in demo how you can uh, use this method, how you can call this method basically. So I am taking here one firstcry.com uh, um, uh, example here and I will click on the support hyperlink. So it will redirect it to uh, you a new tab and it will open multiple windows basically. Sometimes we can call these windows like parent window, child windows. So it, that's uh, the way we can uh, use this term like uh, multiple windows uh, opened in automation. So let me show you uh, how we can use this quit method and what, what is the difference between basically in quit and close method. So again, I'm using Maven project here. And as you can see, the project name is same, uh, sample selenium framework. And uh, let me create uh, another class for this uh, demo. Let me create one class. I'm giving class name is close browser. And uh, as this is a very simple Java class, so let me add a main method here. Static void main string here. Yes. Yeah, so main method is done. And uh, here I'm initializing my web driver. So I'm using here uh, Chrome web driver basically. And by using get method, I just want to open at www.firstcry.com website and after opening this uh, website i just want to maximize it so driver.manage.window.maximize and uh, let me just show you that example so and then i'll show you what exactly i want to um, capture here so it will open a Chrome browser and it will redirect it to firstcry.com and uh, then it will maximize. So in uh, for this scenario, I want to click on the support method. So once we click on the support, it will redirect it to another uh, tab. Basically, two tabs will be open there. So let me write that thing. So to redirect that uh, support link, I am using uh, driver dot find element so basically we are using this find element to uh, access uh, any element what element is present in the web page and uh, here i'm giving uh, by dot x path basically x path expression i'm giving here it's saving the time i'm just copying it and pasting the x path expression here and uh, by using click method i just want to click on this method and uh, after that i just want to show you how this close method will work and how we can use the quit method so for now i'm using this driver close method and let me put some weight here so that you can easily observe like what is happening with the using of this close method let me just fix this error basically we have to add this exception here so for now, you can just ignore this exception. Um, I'll let you know 
in my later videos what is the exactly ex uh, ex uh, exceptions there so let me rerun the program it will open first cry.com and uh, it will redirect it to support page basically so, uh, it will take few moments basically yeah so first cry is open and it will open support so two tabs are there and after five seconds it will close that first parent tab okay but it is not closing all the tabs so basically uh, if we want to close all the tabs which was operated or which was automated by this script this selenium script we have to use this quit method so let me just command this method and i'm just using driver one second driver dot quit method now you can observe let me again execute this script so it will basically open multiple tabs and it will uh, close all the tabs which was op opened by uh, automation basically so as i put it five second wait uh, so it will it's waiting for five second and uh, yeah it's close all the tabs so basically when you are using this quit method it will quit the browser and what are the uh, tabs are open uh, by using this script it will close all the tabs and when you use this close method it will close only current tab so yeah that's it uh, for this video i hope you understand the concept and you understand the difference between close and quit method so i hope this content is really helping you uh, to get more familiar and more understandable with this selenium predefined methods and uh, in my next session i'll cover few more topics about the selenium like uh, how we can find any particular web element on back page and how we can click any particular uh, web element or any basically hyperlink and uh, uh, how we can pass any text to any text field or text area so i will cover few predefined uh, methods as well like uh, click method or uh, find elements method and send keys method so yeah